what should be our focus is to make sure that people get their monthly pensions before we go talking about the effective percent. And PTAB's uh, focus now is to make sure every pensioner that is not on a payroll is verified. So we're going on to the northeast next week, Monday on the 28th, to verify all the pensioners in the northeast, starting with Adamawa, uh, Gumbe, Bauchi, and Taraba states to get them verified. Once we finish that, we move to the south south to verify them. After the South South, we move to Southwest. We need to complete the verification exercise for all the defined benefit skin pensioners under PITAT. We have a call center. So, for complaints, people call in. We now have a call center that people call in and their complaints are resolved. We have six state offices as well. And we intend to have uh, state offices in the 36 states. Nigeria, the same way that news agency of Nigeria has. That's why my being here is key for me, because it's like a collaboration. News agency of Nigeria can bridge that gap where we have that gap. We have six state offices, we have in Lagos, we have in Kaduna, we have in uh, Enugu. When it started, it wasn't really on a zonal basis. It's as I came in now, I'm trying to make sure we have in the 36 days. Like once we finish the verification in the northeast, we cannot live without establishing a Yola office because I know that there will be some pensioners who might not be able to get to the verification, who will miss out the verification. They can now bring their documents to the Yola office and we get them verified. And also we do mobile verification for those who are infirm, sick or hospitalized. But we cannot do diaspora verification for one pension department. You know, we have four operational pension departments. What we're doing now in the Northeast is the civil service pension department, yes. So CIPO, or CIPID as we call it now, have put forward a memo for diaspora verification. What I've said is that they should marry it with the police, because you'll have police pensioners who are outside the country. You'll have parastatals, people who are outside the country. And you'll have the civil service as well.